Taylor Swift embracing Celine Dion backstage at the Grammys. Taylor Swift. <laughs> after she accepted her Album of the Year award from the music icon, who made a surprise appearance amid her battle with stiff person syndrome. Life imposes things on you. You, ha you have no choice. You have to deal with them. Another surprise? Well, some fans were left scratching their heads. After Tay seemed to hug everyone on the award show stage, everyone but the Power of Love singer. Now, I'm not mad at Taylor Swift at all, but she did walk up on that stage and hug everybody except Celine. Fans, including Shamar Moore, were concerned Tay didn't pay Queen Celine her dues on stage. Just watch the Grammys. I'm a little bit caught off guard. What are we doing? Oh, in the excitement, she didn't realize we were going, no. But we're gonna chalk it up to Tay being lost in the live TV moment. Thank you all. I love you right back. See, it was a one-two punch of a shock. First, Celine's appearance wasn't announced until she hit the stage, her first major public appearance since announcing her diagnosis. And second, Taylor made history in the moment, becoming the first four-time winner of the Grammy's top honor. All I want to do is keep being able to do this. I love it so much. And how about history repeating itself here? Rewind to 2013, Celine and Taylor at the Billboard Music Awards, handing over Tay's Artist of the Year trophy. Yep, this time an onstage hug included. That's always really fun when award shows turn into more of like a girls' night situation. But back to this Sunday, ET learned Celine wanted to be part of music's biggest night and was feeling good amid her struggle with the neurological disorder. When I say that um, I'm happy to be here, I really mean it. And it's worth pointing out another theory, some Swifties suggesting Taylor wanted to play it safe on stage out of concern for the ailing singer. Those who have been blessed enough to be here, the Grammy Awards, must never take for granted the tremendous love and joy that music brings to our lives. I'm doing everything that I can to recuperate. Celine first shared her diagnosis over a year ago. People can die from complications from the disease. It's serious. Dr. Tara Zier, who isn't treating Celine but has stiff person syndrome herself, told ET Celine is potentially facing debilitating side effects. Many people with this condition have uh, difficulty with mobility. Uh, and require assisted aids for mobility, like uh, walkers, wheelchairs. Uh, some people are, are bedridden. They can have spasms so severe that they break bones, dislocate joints, result in life-threatening breathing problems. What we do know, Celine's appearance Sunday earned roaring applause, a standing ovation, and a joyful smile from her fellow songstress. I'm alive. Mm -hmm. We have to live one day at a time.